In this video we will talk about how we can fix this kind of error. So the error occurs when you are trying to activate uh, Windows or Microsoft Office. The error code would be 0xc004f074. So the way to fix this will be just click on start then just type cmd right click and make sure to run it as administrator. Run as admin and yes so the first command that will be sfc space forward slash scan now then enter so the sfc of scan now um, what it does will uh, it will scan the system files and it will try to uh, fix it so usually it will only take uh, a few minutes so just wait for it until it finish Once it is finished, the next command will be running the DISM. The DISM will also try to repair uh, the Windows system files and it will scan it. So just type DISM space forward slash cleanup um, image space restore health. Then enter. Well, since like I'm missing something, so again that will be DISM space forward slash uh, online space forward slash cleanup image restore help and enter. Okay, then just wait for it to finish. It will only take a few minutes as well. So I just wait for it. So once it is already completed, uh, you will get uh, a message that the restore operation completed successfully. So after that, you need to run again um, SFC um, scan now just to finalize it to completely repair the system files. Then enter. Then just wait for a few minutes again. Once it is completed, um, the final step will be let's uh, close it first. The final step will be running the um, troubleshoot. Just click on start, then type in troubleshoot settings open it then uh, just click on other troubleshooters after that um, look for Windows update uh, once you have the Windows update just click on run and um, just click on run then it will try to, to fix it it will try to update it then once it's already been updated once it's already been completed just restart your computer and Hopefully, it will fix the problem. So that's it. That's the, the simplest way on how you can fix this kind of problem, like the activation problem in Windows. This will work in both Windows 10 and Windows 11. So hope you find this video helpful. And if don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. If you do have any question, um, just comment down below, and I'll try to answer it. Thanks again for watching.